In this video, we will be basically talking about how you can write an essay with the use of ChatGPT. Like we all know, ChatGPT is an artificial intelligence which actually helps in solving most of our problems, our daily problems, right? So it's an open AI. If you're new to it, you can go to chat.openai.com to get started. You sign up and you're good to go. So once you're done signing up, this is the interface you will see. This is how it looks when you come there. That is for people who are new to it. So now let's start by saying, by asking ChatGPT, Chat GPT, what is open AI? Uh, what is essay? Pardon me, please. So we say, what is an essay. So he will he will go ahead and give us a true meaning of an essay. So once we know the meaning of an essay, we can now proceed to talk about to 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 tell ChatGPT to help us write an essay. Okay, let's say look at it. Look at the response. An essay is a piece of writing that per, that that presents an argument, analysis, or discussion on a particular topic. It is typically a non-fiction piece of writing that expresses the author viewpoint or interpretation of a subject. Essay can take various forms and length ra ranging from a view paragraph to hundreds of pages. So now let's, let's proceed by doing this. So we'll say, okay, okay, let's be done reading it for, for so that we'll not skip any step. Essay are often assigned as academic assignments, but they can also be written for personal, professional, or creative purposes. They can be persuasive, informative, descriptive, or reflective in nature, depending on the author's intent and the type of essay. Common type of essay include argumentative essay, descriptive essay, narrative essay, expository essay, and, pers and persuasive essay. So now let's tell ChatGPT, since we know the type of essays we have now, let's say for instance, we want to write uh, uh, a persuasive essay. Okay, so we'll ask ChatGPT, it is always important we are fully educated about what we want to write before we head straight to write it. And this actually helps you build the, 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 the understanding of the uh, artificial intelligence to know who you are and what you're heading where you're heading to so we go we hesitate and ask chat gpt at that what is a persuasive essay let's see since we want to write a persuasive essay let's see what uh, chat gpt will say a persuasive essay is a type of essay in which the author presents an argument and attempts to persuade the reader to agree with their point of view. The author uses evidence, logic, and reasoning to convince the reader to adopt their position on a particular topic or issue. In a persuasive essay, the author typically starts with an introduction that presents the topic and provides background information. This essay then presents the author's argument, which is typically supported by evidence and examples. The author may also address uh, counter arguments and offer a uh, rebuttal to them. The conclusion of the persuasive essay summarizes the, the main point of the essay and restates the author's position, often leaving the readers with a call to action or a final thought to consider. Example of topics for a persuasive essay might include controversial issues such as gun control, climate change, or, or death penalty. The goal of persuasive essay is not only to convince the reader or the, author, or the author's position, but also to inspire them to take action or change their behavior. Okay, now, so once we're done with that, let us proceed to know, to, to, to write an essay about, okay, about the last uh, presidential election. So we we'll, we'll tell ChatGPT, write, a persuasive essay. Sorry, write a persuasive essay about the Nigeria presidential election. Okay, so let's see what Chachi Pitu say. We, I may not be full, uh, really uh, precise, but let's see. Let's see the response. 
As one of the most populous countries in Africa, Nigeria holds a significant position in the in the continent. Okay, I think I'm loving this uh, this response. The continent political and elect elect. Uh, economic landscape. Pardon my reading. I am having a kind of sight issue a little. The country presidential election held every four years is a crucial event that determines the leadership and direction of the nation for the next term. In this essay, I will argue that the Nigeria presidential election is a crucial event that requires active participation from citizens to ensure a transparent and credible electoral process. Firstly, the Nigeria presidential election is an opportunity to, to, for citizens to exercise their democratic right and choose their leaders. You can see the way it, it came up. It is very okay. And if you're not cool with the response, you can just head straight down and say, regenerate response. So just charge people to understand and regenerate another response for you that is completely different from what you earlier wrote. You can see, say, as as Nigeria prepares for its next presidential election, it is important to, for citizens to carefully consider their vote and choose a candidate who can lead the country towards progress and prosperity. The upcoming election is a critical moment in Nigeria history, and the country faces numerous challenges such as corruption, poverty, and insecurity. In, it is therefore imperative that Nigeria elects a competent and visionary leader who can effectively address this issue. You can see one of the key qualities that a candidate for the Nigeria presidential should process is a commitment to transparency and accountability. You can see this response is also as well good. You keep generating until when you get a good response. I do hope you find this video very helpful. If you find it very helpful, endeavor to click on the red subscribe button below this video to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And what you do with that, endeavor to click on the bell icon beside it because what we do here basically is we talk about uh, a lot of things like this, a lot of content like this, and we know you wouldn't want to miss it. Thank you for your time and bye bye. My name is Deji Ajibui, and welcome to my channel, Coach Silas. Bye bye, and see you next on my next.